more hunter tech. Don't mind if I do. Help out EMF. Where's that kiosk? Hello, Peter. As you can see, these cassava plants are alive and quite hardy, but grow too slowly for food production. We want to hybridize them with a productive variety and would welcome your help. Cassava plants growing too slowly, huh? Better head to ESU. A professor there just discovered a new variety that grows impressively fast. They'd make a great hybrid. Their rare variety of the Asian cassava plant grows like crazy. And I'll only need a single leaf to splice with ours. The professor is always looking for practical applications. Stole the cassava? I've got to track down the thieves before they get too far. Maybe there are some traces of pollen still in the air. Got it. Glad this plant is a wind pollinator. It releases so much pollen, I can see the path they took. Now let's see where these pilfering plantsmen went. There it is. That's like a rock star plant with all that security. something to plant. My fist in your face! Right there! He's up there! I need this plant for an experiment to help feed New York if that means anything to you. No? Really? I'll get you! What kind of plant is this? I think it's called the back to jail plant! Throwing that thing! Give me a break, Spider-Man! Now where is that plant? We couldn't have walked far. All right, buddy. One quick stop at feast, and then we'll get you back home. Glad we nipped this nefarious plant in the bud. See what I did there? Yeah, I knew you would. Wait, your name's not Audrey, is it? Parker, stop talking to the plant! Okay, now to borrow a bit of your super special genetic material to help your cousins grow faster. Okay, so we want some extra growth genes from our guest plant. Let's see. There he is! Huh? Oh no, you're not touching that! Oh, that plant must be really special to you! It's in that machine thingy! Adam, Spider thinks he's so smart. Did I say that? We just followed you straight back. <laughs> Spider-Man! <sighs> Let's try that again. How do these fit together?
And there we go. The plant will be secure in this workbench until ESU can buff up their greenhouse security. Feast will really be able to improve their crop yield with these new hybrids. Dr. Yeah. Mm, bring it on. Hello, Peter. Let's do one last training session. You know the drill. Help the drone identify predators as well as optimal nesting sites. Just gotta boot up the drone. Let's do some target practice. Gotcha! One down. Bullseye. Yes. Always nice to be flying around Brooklyn. Let's mark those nest sites. Yeah, let's get it back in the garage. What? What just happened? Did someone steal the drone? I'll head to its last location before it went dark. See if I can figure out where it went. Hmm, no sign of it. Or anyone. Those guys said something about a garage. There's a few close by. If I can find the right one, I should be able to reconnect to the drone from the roof. Better start checking out these garages. No signal. This can't be the place. No connection. Must not be this one. Bingo. This is the place. Let's connect the video signal. What is this place? And more importantly, how do I get in there? Lots of cages in here. More bees. I don't know why these guys are collecting bees. But I know they don't belong cooped up in here. I'd better turn on that sonic laser mode. Let's kill two bees with one shot. I free them, and then that'll help me get that door open. That bug packing heat? What's it doing? Definitely let Dr. Young know about this poaching operation. It's no good for the bees, real or drone.
Instead of going to counseling, he went somewhere else. When we confronted him, he said some threatening things and then left. Hopefully he just needs to cool off, but if you see him or hear from him, can you let us know? Thank you. Uh, this just went from bad to worse. sound like a trap at all. Just hope he hasn't hurt Betsy and Cole.
Okay, where's Beck? Welcome, Spider-Man. If you're looking for Betsy and Cole, they are no longer with us. You killed them? Don't act surprised. You've known from the beginning who you're dealing with. What the... out there. How is that happening? <laughs> Enough of this! I'll end you myself! You actually think you can defeat me? This is something! Everything that has happened is because I wanted it to happen! Now you're just making excuses! <laughs> I control everything! I am a god! Your reality is what I deem it to be! It's over. So, you managed to survive. Doesn't matter. Alive or dead, you will never escape my world.
Nice try. Clutch Spider-Man. When you are dead, the city will finally give me the respect I have earned. You want respect? Surprise? Maybe it's time for you to put some respect on my name. Time to get out of here. Guess I gotta get through that wall. The sin is down. Get it back! I'm trying. It was Quentin. He made us do this. Where is he? Help. In here. questions. This should clear things up. So can I tell everyone Mysterio's a good guy now? <laughs> Mysterio will always be a villain. Just as Spider-Man will always be a hero. It's when you start looking at the people behind the masks that things get messy. I think he's on to us. If so, there's only one solution. We need him alive. 
What do we do? Just tie him up or something? Yes! Good idea. We set him up as the fall guy in case anyone catches on. Yeah, like tell everyone he went full Mysterio? Exactly! He would be the one most likely to steal money, not the two women who aren't former supervillains. Now we just need to figure out how to get the richest people in the city into these Mysteriums. Okay, but there's still some code that I haven't figured out, and... The Spider-Men will help us with that. Ha! <laughs> That's brilliant! Heroes always looking to help. And if all goes to plan, we'll have millions in the bank before anyone catches on. And when they do, Quentin goes back to prison. And we retire in style. Looks like the biggest illusion was Betsy and Cole's innocence. Wonder where Beck is going from here. Hunter sure do have a lot of stuff. Craven must be wealthy. Like, oligarch wealthy. 